Hey folks, this is a tip and trick video for intermediate players. It can be useful to beginners as well, so let's get going. It's really important for you to look at the meter of your opponent, and yours of course. And you have an opportunity to look at meter, usually when you're in the process of getting grabbed, when you're getting comboed, things along those lines. When you can't do anything, instead of just looking at the animation of yourself getting comboed, or yourself getting grabbed, or yourself you know, grabbing someone, then take the opportunity to look at the meter. That's even when you're like, you're floored like that, you're downed then take a quick look. So let's say that the opponent is not doing wake up attacks. He's saving it to break away once you combo him, which it depends against which characters, but against some characters, you always want to keep meter to break. For example, against uh, Sonya Blade. She does so much damage when she combos you that you always use a defensive meter to break and you don't use it to wake up. So let's say you're fighting someone who is saving all his defensive meter to break away and you know it. Well, first of all, that gives you an advantage because when he's down, you know he can safely go for meaties and the only obstacle is gonna be a delayed wake up or a normal wake up, right? You might do other things like mash on wake up and stuff, but if you time your meaties properly, you should get them. Which also means if they're not rolling on wake up, that you can combo them, fully combo them. Because usually what you want to do on wake up, you want to check them. It's just a check. Because the problem is if they have bar and roll, when you're trying to go for a meaty using a full combo, you might get punished. So for example, let's say that he's not rolling. I know he's not going to roll, so I can safely go for the meaty that I want to go for. So what I do is I go for this whole string soon as he wakes up. But now he does decide to start rolling. He might punish me because I'm just whiffing like that, which is why, usually to be safe, you just go for a check like this. See how I'm safe? The best the best check, not considering the late wake up, is just down four, down three, down, down one, things along those lines, just checking them. But now you know that he's not going to go for rolls because he's not spending defensive meter on anything other than breaking away. You can use that to your advantage by going for full combos on the meaties, but you have to also use unbreakable combos. Not all characters have unbreakable combos. For example, I don't even think Melina has unbreakable combos and and you can break away immediately against her, but someone like Cassie does have unbreakable combos, Scorpion as well. I think Sub-Zero does have something as well. The thing with unbreakable combos though is that they do less damage, but it's better to, for example, let's say I go for an unbreakable combo right now. Here you go, 230, and I can pressure him because I get a restand and I'm plus 18. All right, 218 is much less than, and I spent two bar. It's much less than if I actually launch him, right? There you go, 306 compared to 230. But the problem is, if he breaks away, look at how much damage I get, 155. So my opinion is that it's better to get the unbreakable combo where they can't break, they don't break, you get the damage that is lower damage than the hypothetical combo that you would get if you would launch, but they're gonna break anyways. Unless you have a good armor breaker, which I don't think Scorpion has, see? You wanna keep it unbreakable, so that's my tip. Keep it unbreakable when they have full bars of meter. Don't keep it unbreakable when they're missing one bar of meter or more. So for example, let's say he does a get up. He does this. And now I see that he's missing one bar of defensive meter. That's when I decide I'm going to launch you because he can't break away. All right. So that's either one or two bars of defensive meter. Missing one or two bars, then you can go for your full combos. But then I realize, okay, he's back to having two bars. Now it's time to keep it unbreakable. So, okay, that, that's, I think you get it. <laughs> 